Hello friends, welcome back to the channel. Today's Tuesday, May 9th. I'm going to do a real quick video here. I'm going to harvest a couple of things and I figured I'd show you that a pretty nice head of cabbage that I'm pretty proud of and I'm going to go over here and harvest it right now and I'll bring it up a little closer to the camera and show you when I do. So here we go, it's right here. This is a big old head of cabbage. Get down here, cut it off close to the ground. Now let me bring it over here closer to the camera. Let's tool up. So look, really nice size head of cabbage. Let's peel these leaves back. Let's see what we got right here. Once you peel the main head leaves back, it's a nice head of cabbage. Almost about the same size as my head. That's pretty good. It's as solid as a rock, too. A little closer look at it. Really nice. No damage, no bug damage that I can see anywhere. But really nice head of cabbage, like I said. I said nice a bunch of times there, didn't I? And uh, so. Let me stick this over here in this basket and then we'll go right here and harvest a few of these red robin tomatoes. As a matter of fact, let me just bring this whole thing a little closer to you. I think the roots have grown through the bottom. So we got a pot in a pot. You can see there's bunches of tomatoes on that little tiny plant. So many tomatoes on it, it's leaning over on its side. The plant itself ain't, ain't but about that tall and it still got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, probably at least twenty tomatoes. I'm gonna go ahead and get a couple of these that ain't quite right. They're starting to blush and I'm gonna go ahead and just get them before bug gets it. They'll ripen on the counter. And anyway, there's still several tomatoes left on that little tiny plant. And actually right in there with it, it's a little bit of lettuce. Might as well cut some of that. While I'm at it. Matter of fact, I think it's about time to fill up on these lettuce plants but we'll see. And I'll have enough for a little salad right here when I'm done. So a nice little handful of lettuce, fresh lettuce. Mm. A few tomatoes. Here we have us a little salad going. But anyway, I just figured I'd show y'all what my little harvest there of the cabbage. Uh, everything's going pretty good over here. Matter of fact, let me just turn the camera over here and show you. So, see right here. That raised bed, everything's looking good. We got tomatoes and matter of fact, I just probably need to take it off the stand. That's what I'm gonna do. All right, that's better. I got it off the stand now. Y'all can actually see what's going on here. So here you can see we got some beans growing in the front and uh, tomatoes are looking good back there. I got a little trellis. You probably can't see it that good, but may have some fence that I'm putting up there for the tomatoes to grow on let's come over here to this other bed and get a good look at it it's even nicer so the ones in the back are slicers but they're dwarfs they probably ain't supposed to get more than about three feet or so and the ones in the front here are cherry tomatoes you can see they're all looking nice and healthy there's even some small tomatoes starting to develop on these i don't know there's one right there Anyway, everything is looking super healthy here. I'm looking forward to a really good tomato harvest coming up. 
and uh, again thank y'all for watching the video and checking out my little harvest of the day uh, appreciate everyone who watches and if you like subscribe share all that helps me out so anyway with that enjoy your day <laughs>